So speaking of weightlifting, Ken picks up with one of our favorite topics of recent times. I know you've covered the armor building complex from so many angles, and thank you for your endless attention to this topic. Ken, I answer the questions as they come in, so I guess I have to answer what you like, yeah. I'm currently 39, I've been trained with kettlebells for three years. I'm now looking to set a three month target to achieve with the ABC. I love three month programs, by the way, and I don't get bored easily. Ken, there's a chance by the time this uh, comes out that my new book uh, on uh, the armor building complex will, will have come out. What's sweet about that is that uh, the armor building complex, at least a couple of the programs come right around three months and it's a good one. I currently do the ABC with double 20 kilo bells every minute on the minute for 12 minutes. By that point, my heart rate has gone uh, gradually climbed to about 150. So you're 39. Um, yeah, yeah, that's 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 high, but not bad for 12 minutes. Uh, um, but, but that's fine. And I'm also feeling enough fatigue in my muscles that if I kept going, I'd probably risk deteriorating form. And and thank you for stopping well before that happens. My gut tells me double 24 bells for 30 minutes is achievable. Yes, it is after three months of work. But does that sound too ambitious for someone who's building up to that level for the first time in his life? What additional key information is still missing to help me make a determination? So one of the things I want to share with you in the new book, I talk about, so there are weeks where we, so just real simple, and I'll just, I'll do it as basic as I can. Week one, you do the ABC twice. There's going to be someone asking, what's the ABC? So let me tell you, but armor building complex, two kettlebells, double kettlebells. You do two cleans, one press, three front squats, put the weight down. ABC, armor building complex. Um, week one, you go twice. Week two, you go once. Week three, you go twice. Week four, you go once. On the once weeks, so the, on weeks uh, two and four, those are the weeks I'd like you to extend those minutes out. So you're currently at, uh, I got you at 12. So next time you come up uh, on, say it's the Wednesday workout, middle workout of the week, whatever it is, uh, I want you to build up to 13 minutes and maybe even try 15 minutes. The following week, I want your two ABC workups to tally up more than that Wednesday single workout. So if you went, let me just jump ahead for 20 minutes because the math is just a little bit easier with, for me. If you did 20 minutes on uh, week two, uh, uh, every minute on the minute with the 20s, on week three, two workouts, and I'd like to see you try something like maybe 10 minutes on the Monday workout, 15 minutes on the other workout. It could also be uh, 12 and 8. It could be... It could be 15 and something less. I wouldn't say five. That well, It's an option. I shouldn't d deny it. But if you went 15 and 10, now you're at 25 minutes for the week, which is a big jump, you know, but still not a bad idea. So if you're trying to up the ABC numbers, try that method. So basically on the single weeks, those are the, that's the tough workout. That's the workout where you're really trying to attack more numbers. And that's the idea. Uh, when you walk in, you say, okay, my best is, uh, I want to get to uh, 30 minutes with the, with the 12, uh, with the twenties. I want to get to 30 and I'm at 15 now. Okay. So this week I'm going to do, I'm going to try for 16. If 16 feels good, I'll go to 17 and then natural cutoff. The next week, you look at that 16, 17, 18, kind of divide by two and then hedge the numbers a little bit. If it's 17, then you might want to go uh, 10 and eight the next week or something like that. So you basically add up plus a little bit on the doubles weeks. I know this is a lot of math, but it makes sense when you do it. Uh, it will seem like what I'm telling you to do is this. Wednesdays are your heavy days. The following week, you have a medium and an easy day. Yes, that's true. But what you're trying to do is nudge that Wednesday workout up. That's why I think it takes about, well, you gave you gave yourself a great time, uh, three months. I mean, that gives you, I mean, that gives you 
six opportunities to go one, two, one, two, one, two. One day a week, two days a week, one day a week, two days a week, one day a week, two days a week. And when you accumulate all those reps up, I think that'll trend you in the right direction. Ken, personally, when I look at your goal, uh, I wouldn't mind seeing you try to get that double 20s first at 30 minutes. And I think what you're going to find, it's only going to take a couple of weeks to get the double 24s in the 30 minutes too. It'll take you a little while to get up there at the double 20s, the accumulated volume. It won't take you nearly as long to match those 20s with the 24. I can't tell you how long that's going to be. You know, it's one of those, your mileage may vary kind of things. But it's a, it's a good goal, and I like what you said here. Thank you. That's very good.